You're looking at the wrong person. They're looking at yourself. Actually, can a psychic look at their own future? Eh, who really cares? Wing attack. This should take it out, I think. Thank you. So these can technically be double battles, but you can obviously turn them into single battles if you really want to. Uh, I didn't know that on my first play, th uh, on my first uh, run through of Diamond. Even during when I think I got Pearl at some point, I still didn't do it. When a trainer a Pokemon bond is won, a wondrous power is born. I don't think I knew that. I think only later on did I know that because I saw a YouTube video, I think, of it. So I'm just saying, yeah, you can just skip them. I'm like, wait, what? You could? I thought they were all mandatory. But no, only the first one's mandatory. I think as a kid, I think I tried to see if I could, like, kind of sneak around them kind of thing. Uh, wing attack. And then I should take it out, right? Like the other one? Yep. Amber's not really that good. Alright, there you go. Oh, I skipped his text. Dang it, man. I was distracted with my stopwatch. My bad. I apologize for that. I was distracted when I stopped watching. I'm like, is that actually right? And I was going to alt-tab when we get to a different trainer battle. And I wasn't paying attention. My bad. I don't need any of these mons. Alright, I want to see. It's actually right. I guess that's a little bit off, but not that bad. Alright. So in about 10 minutes or so, I'm going to have to take a little break. Mostly just refill my drink for the most part. Uh, it's going to use Protect. That's fine. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Oh, it might have different moves now, but I thought it was going to use Protect. It does not. Okay. Brickatoon. Wing attack. Oh, I was going to say, I'm not going to be able to take it down, but I'll definitely be able to take it down next turn, but I guess not. How come I thought Cricketune would have survived that? I don't know. Ah, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I don't know if I said that completely, but I'd be laughing if I actually did. Here comes the swarm! Oh no! The swarm is here! Purple? That's fine. You wanna know what I think? I think Ace Wing can do it. You also wanna know what I think Ace Wing can do? Ace Wing can wing attack this swarm pole and take it out. I think this guy was supposed to pair off with that other bug catcher that we faced, like the first bug catcher we faced in this forest. The one that had that beautifly. Because it seems kind of weird that this one has, like, the same thing. Oh, Monkai leveled up. Nice. Did you learn a new move, man? No. Yeah, I think these two are supposed to pair off instead of that last. Would have been a better pair, is what I mean. Actually, I'll wait till we get out of the forest, I think, and then I'll... Take a little break. Oh! Item. Mine. Yeah, I'm trying to, like, collide with the trees so my character goes slowly. But I don't think it's working nearly as much as I think it should. <gasps> no, it's still up. It's fine. Oh, a strong presence has been felt. It is emanating from you. Sorry. My bad. I skipped it because I looked away and I went, oh man. Rachel and Cody. Alright. Psyduck and Metatite. I can take out the Metatite in like one shot. The Psyduck, Cheryl, I need you to kind of 
stall it a little bit. That Metatite's not gonna be able to do anything. Wing attack, Metatite. Boom. Yeah, I think there's a way you could probably play this without actually like avoiding like like uh, with avoiding a lot of trainers. But Shadow's here just as an aid kind of thing for the most part, and as a healer. So like she'll heal our Pokemon after each fight, so it's actually really good for me. Sweet kiss. Okay. Oh, it might be over. It might be over. Nope. Yeah, just hit it. Thank you. Your victory. There is nothing strange about it. Oh, be one with me, my Metatype. Don't take that out of context. Please. Uh, I think over here. I think that's it for trainers, I think. Got a jar of honey. Nice. There's the exit. Oh, there's the exit. I'm so relieved. We finally got here. I would have never been able to get through this by myself. Thank you so much, Dramore. You're welcome. All right, that's it. All right. Now we got this route. It's fine. Run out here. I'm gonna go and heal in about five minutes. I'll technically be pausing the recording. By pausing, I mean I'll end this as a session, and then I'll just start a new one. All right, let's go. See what we can else we can do here. Is he actually here now? No, he's not. Okay, he's probably there at the end of the game. Nope, oh, still didn't get the mystery gift unlocked yet. Don't know when that's happening. Oh, <gasps> Cynthia, Is my hair good. Hi, Cynthia. Oh, is that a Pokedex? You must be helping for Zeroan. Yes, I am. I I am helping him. What's your name? It's, it's uh... Dramore. Oh, hello, Dramore. I'll be sure to remember that name. Oh, my God, guys. She knows my name. Oh, my name is Cynthia. I, I know. I'm a trainer just like you. She's like, uh, she's like, my name is Cynthia. I know. It's like, how do you know? Um. Uh, okay. Uh, I've been studying Pokemon mythology lately, just out of curiosity. Here in Eternus City, there is a statue of an ancient Pokemon. According to myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows, you may encounter something like that while you're traveling with your Pokedex. Try using these, they should help you on your way. TM93s. Is that cut? Cut in the hidden moves that allows you to chop down trees in a small way. Remember, you can use the hidden move cut from your Pokéx in the field. It lets you go to places that were previously inaccessible to you. That's important for filling up your Pokédex, right? Then luck be with you, young trainer. Bye, Cynthia. My love. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. Oh, now that you actually get to see the statue, it actually does look like that. Okay. All right. Come on. Give me it. Give it to me. There we go. The dragon fight. There is a text engraved in the back of the obtained plate. When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. I put the dragon plate in there. All right, so now our dragon moves can go up by 20%. Now, like, that actually kind of helps. We don't use dragons, so... Hey, we can't really use that yet. Oh, 
Hey, do you guys have anything? Turner came to be long ago in honor of an ancient Pokemon, though many things have changed. What is important has not. I hope it remains that way forevermore. Okay. Have you seen the Pokemon statue? I have. When I was a wee child, it used to be the centerpiece of many festivals. You're old. Anyway. No item here? Oh, there it is. I was gonna say, is there not an item here? I thought there was. Alright. Yeah, I think the... I think next time we face in the second gym, I think we have to remove the Team Galactic threat, I think. in here I don't really care actually I think the name writers there as I used to call them the name router because I didn't actually know that it is actually how you spelled Raider so I thought that was ratter okay underground guy hey buddy let's dig up some treasure I'm from Orberg I work at the mining museum I got advice from the underground man on digging up fossils and spheres, before I get digging, let me share his advice with you. While you're digging, you may uncover dark rocks. They are very hard. If you keep hitting them, the wall will collapse. Keep that in mind, and you'll be digging up treasure in no time. I'm the first one to have started digging out the Grand Underground. I am, you can call me, the Underground Man. Everyone else does. I'll make you, I'll make a gift of this to you. You, you hold up your end of the deal, and you can put it to good use. Okay, anytime we go to a, an area that I think it should be a really good time to check the underground, I'll do it. You put the Explorer Kit in your bag's key items pocket. Use the Explorer Kit from your key items pocket to visit the underground. Help me mentor you as you become a full-fledged spelunker. Just follow my lead. Don't tell me you're actually going to lead me underground. First, go to the Grand Underground. Going underground is quite easy. Simply use your Explorer Kit. It can't be used indoors or in a cave. Now give it a try. Hey! Hey! He hacked my switch! I didn't do that! I didn't want to go through this now. Hey, Dramor, this is your first time here? Yes, now leave me alone. Welcome to Sinnoh's Grand Underground. There's a network of t uh, tunnels, caves, and caverns lying beneath Sinnoh. Huh? What am I doing down in this expanse of a place? That's kind of hard to answer. I mean, you can do pretty much anything you want down here. I can steal things? Nice. For instance, you can dig up fossils and treasure, or you can make your own secret base. You should talk to the underground man in Eternity City to learn more. Why is the way? To go back to the surface? Remember, why? Why do I want to go back to the surface? Uh, I have to get going now. I'll see you, see you around. Okay, I think this might be something I can do, maybe? Is there an indicator of one I can... Oh. I don't see a difference. The ball is bulging slightly. Would you like to try digging into it? Sure. Oh. There is a note tucked inside the Explorer Kit. Digging for fossils. I put a sledgehammer and pick... That's not how you spell pickaxe, by the way. There's supposed to be an E at the end. In your Explorer Kit, use them. And you'll be able to dig out all sorts of stuff from the walls. Before the wall comes cr tumbling down, that is. I'm sure you can do it. Good luck, youngster. Something pinged in the wall. Four confirmed. If I remember correctly, just hammer. Oh, what is that? Okay, I got a green thing. Oh, what is that? What is that? I don't know what that is. It's new to me. Oh, okay. <gasps> I found it. Boom! Oh, that's not the fourth item. I thought that was. <laughs> oh. Uh, the whole wall's gonna come crumbling down. Yep. The wall collapsed. But I did get stuff. 
I got a green sphere S. Don't know what that's for. Got another green sphere S. That's cool. What's the last item? I got a pretty stone box. What's that for? Started to shine. It's a loot box. What? An Alakazam statue appeared. Eh? Yes, I'd like to go back to the service. Alright, that's going to be it. Uh, I'm going to take a little break, but for you guys, it's going to be... Oh. Aha, I see that you've gone underground. Well done. Take these as a reward. Red Sphere S. I don't know what those are for. Blue Sphere S and Green Sphere S. There are apparently some Pokemon in the Grand Underground that you can't normally find around here. Meeting a new Pokemon is 100 times more fun than when it's a rare one. Your road to becoming... to being an... Uh, Spelunker has barely begun. If you want to know more, just come visit me. Alright. Thank you. Alright, so that's going to be it. As I said, I'm just going to take a little break, refill my drink, and, uh, yeah, to you guys, it's going to be a new session, but to me, it's going to be something different. Alright, I'll see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond.